We interrupt our program to bring you a special broadcast. Hey, it's Kyle, another League of Legends video. I'm playing some live Quinn gameplay. Quinn and Valor, I should say. I'm actually going to the top lane with this crazy bird lady. Um, and I want to do a live commentary. This is a normal game, not a ranked game. I have yet had the vigor to, and the tenacity to take my Quinn to the top, to, uh, to ranked play yet. But hey, that's, that's all gonna happen from time to time. That's just fine. Not a big worry there, but, um, I'm gonna go ahead and cover blue, and I'm gonna do it valiantly. Oh, hello. Okay, so it looks like they're invading, but uh, not too scary. I did have to use my ward, uh, but that's okay. I guess it just means Lee Sin is going to start blue. I kind of wish I had started with my lifesteal quince. I think I took f 15 AD, uh, flat armor, yellows, and then scaling MR blues. Um, so I don't, I'm not going to be able to lifesteal this bag very well, which kind of stinks. Oh, looks like Nidalee just DC'd. Awesome! Great! Great time to DC, huh? Well, hopefully Akali doesn't get too much free farm. That's sad. Well, oh shoot, I'm gonna have to go against Aatrox too. I hate Aatrox. He's so annoying. Oh, Aatrox. I mean, I feel like I can be able I'll be able to handle him because uh playing Quinn and I can just kind of keep him away. If especially if we can mark my E. Let's see, go ahead and get So okay, so one thing I found about Quinn is that a huge part of her damage comes from her passive. Um, and when I say huge, I mean like pretty much all of it. But uh, so, so that's that's definitely something you need to take advantage of. Right there, when the passive gets procced on your enemy, you need to really make sure that you take advantage of that. Uh, and then also using her E to proc it for you is a fantastic choice. Um, ooh, I'm really glad actually that I picked win against this guy because I just he is definitely auto attack reliant so I'm gonna really want to punish him with my Q there we go using that passive to last hit very very nicely I'm gonna get auto attack passive all right I guess E and then passive auto attack a very very potent combo um, gonna go ahead and take my W there because I was not able to ward uh, as, as effectively as I would have wanted to. I had to use my ward to help cover that steel. How did I not get that? Hmm, interesting. Oh, I was going to jump on him. I don't think Nidalee has come back yet. I could be in trouble for a gank. I don't even know exactly who their jungler is. Oh my gosh, missing CS left and right. There we go. i take another point in my E. Uh, I have yet to really figure out if it's better to max E or Q first. Um, let's see here, 18 to 8. Very nice beginning there. I'm gonna go ahead and blind him. Oh, missed my blind. JK. JK, guys. Just kidding. Nice. A little bit of poke under turret. Never hurt anybody. Except for Aatrox. He definitely got hurt by it. I'm gonna pop a flask pot, because there's no reason to let it sit down in your inventory like that. You might as well use him. I'm just gonna make him pay every time he decides to come up. We're gonna punish him. Uh, one thing about Quinn top lane is she is fantastic against melee champions. Aatrox has yet to really get hip to my strategies here. But she is fantastic at shutting down melee champions, especially guys like this Aatrox, who are very dependent on auto attacks. Other champions like Udyr or Master Yi, Trindamir, uh, all those good old-fashioned auto attack melees are really going to struggle against against this bird lady. Ooh, hello. Gonna check for a gank, and... Get a little bit more of the deeps off onto that, this Mr. Aatrox. I wish I knew... Okay, he's out of pots, so that's good, but I'm a little low right now. Uh, I don't want to take too much damage from this minion wave. Uh, one thing about top lane that people really underestimate is how much damage you actually take from minions. I mean, it is... It's pretty crazy. Oh my gosh. I really wish I would have popped his passive there. Oh, I'm scared. I think I can get a second tower. Oh, shoot. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's miss all the creeps.
Oh, I missed a lot of that CS1. Okay, this tower is being really unfriendly to me right now. My goodness! It's like I forgot how to last hit for a moment there. Okay, I got my bird. I really want to consider... I have no more sustain. Oh, Nidalee is still DC. That's too bad. Come on. Oh my gosh, I really want to go on him. Oh my gosh, he flashed. Well, oh, I'm trying to figure out if I want to dive him. There, I got his passive down at least. That is so, that is so dumb. See, the thing that I really don't like about Aatrox's passive... Got him. The thing I really don't care for about Aatrox's passive is it has no it has no counterplay. Whereas Zack and, you know, uh, what's the bird lady? Anivia, they both have counterplay with their with their old passive revive ultimate thingies. Um, whereas I feel like you just don't have that same sort of interplay with with Aatrox. You know, there's nothing you can do. He's going to revive no matter what. Uh, and I just I just don't care for that. So, well, we're going to have to go balls deep this game and carry because uh, Nidalee is DC'd. Oh, that makes me so sad. I wish, oh, man, you would think that if she was trying to get back in, she'd be back by now. But I haven't seen her back yet. So if it's 4v5... This could be trouble. How is Akali doing compared to Lee Sin? Is really hanging in there and got a couple of kills, so that's good. So we're really going to have to carry this game. Fortunately, we have Draven versus... Who's bottom? Twitch? Draven's doing well. So our lanes are all doing quite well. It's just that we have no jungler. So that's sad news. You know, because Trundle... You know, he's just free farming away. Hello. Alright, well that was good. Happy with that. Gonna go ahead and pop a flask stack. Um, looks like my BF sword paid off. So that's good. Happy about that. Um, like I said, Quinn really can shut down a, a guy like Aatrox. Uh, there's just not a lot that he can do. Not a lot that he can do. Now, one thing I really wonder about, and maybe I'm a little bit annoyed with with this Quinn gameplay, is that the, her passive can be a little bit glitchy. You can see right there, I actually, it had procced onto two targets, and I don't really know, like, how, what the, exactly that means. Like, does it really count on both? Because that'll happen sometimes, where if it's, if it, if, if Valor procs it like, like she just did right there, but then if I proc it with my E, then sometimes it'll, like, get confused. And it will just kind of mess up, so I find that to be a little bit annoying. But I'm doing quite well. Lee Sin's doing quite well. Uh, Trundle is glitching. What in the world is going on? Super confused right now. Well, I need to get boots. I could go for a vamp scepter. I'm going to go boots, and I'm going to get a longsword and a ward. That is perfect right there. I need to get a ward. Trundle, what is going on with you? Oh, get him. Get him, Lee. Nice. Run away, Lee. Oh, Hexy. He oh, shucks. Hmm, you're welcome for the Mia call. You are very welcome. So sorry. Just killed him. Yeah, I probably should have... I don't know, I just... I had just killed him. I'm chunking him pretty hard. Uh, one thing that I do really like to do on Quinn is to build a lot of damage. Um, I feel like a you see a lot of people recommending things like a Blade of the Rune King, which is good because Blade of the Rune King is a very strong dueling item, and Quinn is a very strong duelist. So it makes sense, but personally, I think that building flat AD works much better with her. And just because it scales so well with her passive, um, I, just, I really find it to be a fantastic choice.
That's annoying. Well, I decided to go for the dive. I thought there... I should have really known that his passive would be back up. I don't really know the respawn timer on that yet. Just not that familiar with him yet. But that's pretty obnoxious that he was able to get that kill. Now Lee's going to die. So overall, things are going... I guess maybe he won't. Maybe he won't die. Ooh, Lee, doing work! Lee! Nice. Good job, Lee. Well, this Lee's trying to do work. So am I. So is Draven. I wish we had a Nidalee. If we can, if Akali gets big, that could be real trouble. Real, real trouble, 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 trouble. But that's okay. We're just gonna keep playing. Four v five. There's definitely a chance I will lose this game, but I'm more than just. I'm more just hoping for a good, old-fashioned, well-played, competitive match. More than anything at this point. Call me there just in case something wild or end or crazy happens. I'm gonna go ahead and shove out this lane. I would really like to take this tower if I can and start roaming. Uh, Quinn is a fantastic roamer with the Valor form. Turns her into a monster, and it, it's one of the things why usually when you see Quinn in competitive play specifically, you'll see her in the in the mid lane uh, because she's almost like an AD carry version of Twisted Fate. If that make, kind of makes sense. Uh, she just is so good at her with her high mobility. Um, her ability to roam is just so, so fantastic. So, that's going to kind of be my objective. Let me get an E, auto E. Getting for a ton of deeps. I'm going to go put down my ward just in case the Trundle Man. Lee Sin is doing work. I like this Lee. He's doing work. I still don't have any lifesteal, which is very, very annoying. I really want to fight this Aatrox because... Yeah, if any fight... Oh, I tried to get my ignite off. What? He must have lifestealed like crazy off of me. That's super annoying. That is super annoying. See, that's the... Oh, come on, come on. Flash for it, maybe. Oh, he's going to ward jump. Oh, he missed the Q. That's it. GG right there. Oh, he got out. How is he so tanky? Lee, you're a beast. Good job. Okay, let's go ahead and get Berserker's Greaves. Head back top. Okay, so... Uh, see, I know Aatrox has a ton of lifesteal. I must have missed or forgotten about my Q. That... I must have... I feel like I hit it, though. I don't... Does the bird form Q... It's, a, it's I think it's the same thing. The bird form Q is also the blind, right? Because the blind was my key to winning that trade right there. Getting the blind off was what was going to help me win that trade. And I must have just messed it up. There's Aatrox. He's so scared of me. But now the question is again, is, is, my, is his passive up? Getting a nice couple of two passes off right there. Go ahead and take a flask stack. Just chase him off. I wonder if Lee is going to dive this guy with me. I should have got that. Yep, I see you coming, Lee.
Nice. Good job, Lee. If Akali's here, I'm dead. So I've got to run. I'll take a flash tag just for kicks. I'm gonna try to recall on this brush. This is super risky, but... Nope, Akali just got pwned by the Draven. Or, uh, other way around, she pwned the Draven. Can I get my BT and a ward and run back top? Still trying to get that tower. Really wish Nidalee would reconnect. But Lee is doing work. Kali's getting big, but that's okay. Lee and I hopefully can carry this game. Look out, look out. Just let it go. She's gonna blow you up, my friend. Oh, there's all sorts of... How did how did turret aggro... Oh, Lee Sin, do work. Do work, Lee. Oh, oh. He's doing so much work. I don't even know what's happening up here. How did Lee live? How did Twitch not kill him? Oh boy. I'm gonna blind him. Get a passive off. Charge up some flask stacks. What? Oh, his lifesteal is just so intense. Is so, so intense. I really thought that... I think what happened there, the kicker was that I, I was trying to get out of my bird form and do the execute there. But it just never happened. So that's pretty sad. Alright, well, I think I need to go Frozen Mallet next. Just because I really like Frozen Mallet on kind of this Bruiser Quinn build. Um, I really, really like it, just just because it gives her a lot more, you know, just a little bit more beef, a little bit more utility with the slow, um, both of the things which she could use, you know, she doesn't really, I guess she has a slow on her E, so it's kind of one of those things where if she gets on you, it's just kind of over. Lee, are you going to do this? Nice. This Lee is a beast. I don't even know what's happening anymore. I'm just farming. I'm gonna go mid. I need to start roaming. Let's fight these guys. Let's fight them. I'm gonna go for Twitch now. Come on. I don't think I can handle this trundle, so I'm just going to run away. He scares me. He scares me. Oh, wow, I just one-shot that dude. Man, that worked well. Quinn does have pretty good bursts with her, with her full set of skills. She has definitely strong burst. Ugh. The score would be better if I hadn't lost so many duels with Aatrox. No, I don't want to surrender. I guess if Lee wants to surrender, we're pretty much hopeless. Okay, well... Shoot, I wish Aatrox wasn't doing quite so well. I guess he's not doing that great. I, I can duel this Akali. Oh my gosh. Oh shoot. Should have known. Should have known. This is trouble. This game is just trouble. There's just nothing we can do. And just Draven Draven's having quite an average game. Tarek? What are you doing? Kill her. Good job. Okay, I think I'm going to do something crazy. 
Uh, I think I'm gonna get enchantment boots. Just because I really need to be able to kite. Really, I'm gonna need to be able to kite. This Lee is just monstrous. Oh boy. Mia, be careful. Cow, he's scary. Gonna get his passive down there. He's gonna come back up quite strong, so I can't really duel him. But hopefully if Lee comes, we can make this happen. I burden 20. It's probably not going to be soon enough. And that is a pretty significant movement speed boost. I'll try life steal a little bit off these creeps. Actually, I'm just going to farm them. Oh, i got to go hold this tower. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to hold it. They are chasing Aatrox so far. This could be trouble, 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 trouble. Don't jump on me, Akali. Don't do it. Oh, shoot. Why? Oh, and I popped my ulti there? I thought... I am just failing here. Just failing. I'm thinking all these things that are just not happening. Help, guys, help. I still need to get my giant's belt. Yeah, we're just, we're struggling without this mid laner. It's really making a difference. Oh, boy. See you, Lee. Oh, he's dead. And Draven is a little bit worthless. Yeah, oh, shoot. I wish I had my ulti. If I had my ulti, this would be a very different situation. Oh. She's got so much sustain. Oh my gosh, hope springs eternal. I'm not giving up yet. Nid, you there? Oh my gosh. What? Power outage. All right, well, that'll happen. Okay, well, a bit of an interesting game. Had some trouble with Aatrox just because he is obnoxious with his lifesteal. Thought I could duel him, but uh, ultimately the 4v5 ended up being our downfall. But there's some Quinn gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed it. She's a pretty fun champ, and I really like her in the top lane. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll see you again soon. Bye.